This is John with JWH Consulting with some more tips on working with large data sets in Excel. We've got a large data set here in one of our tabs. We've got some filters on it. We've set, we free some panes to make it easier to navigate. And so what I want to talk about here is some, some keyboard shortcuts to get easily get around your data. So if you want to so you got this, uh, you know, it's a lot of data here, but you don't quite know how much is in here. So instead of, you know, manually scrolling all the way to the bottom, what you're going to do is this is going to be on a Windows machine, control down, and that's going to bring you automatically all to the all the way to the end, to the last cell that's um, populated. And so we see here we have 100, uh, or I'm sorry, is that right? Uh 100, <laughs> 136,000 cells. I'm blown away myself with how many cells there are. Um, but so now we want to go over to the right. And so I'm going to do something similar, control right. And that's going to find the last populated cell moving to the right. So we see the Y column, this cash profit um, column is our last column. And then say I want to go back, I can hit control home. And that'll bring me back to the very top and control end. That'll take me to the very bottom. I actually hit control shift in there. So let's go control home, control end. And then if I do control shift home, I'm actually going to highlight everything back to the first cell here that's unfrozen. And then I can do control shift left and that'll um, populate everything for me. And then say I wanted to copy and paste all this data, control C, let's just start open a new tab. I like to do um, right click, paste, options, values, and this will keep your formatting on your current tab. So that'll do it. Thanks.